What's up guys, Justin here with the SketchupEssentials.com back with another SketchUp extension overview for you. So this week we're going to review an extension that helps you create curves in SketchUp. So let's go ahead and just jump into it. Plugin name, Bezier Spline. Plugin developer, Fredo6. How much does it cost? It's free. Where do you get it? You can download it using the link in the notes below or by searching for Bezier Spline in the Sketchication Warehouse. Tool Functions This extension is a suite of tools designed to help you create better curves in SketchUp. As you know, one area that a base SketchUp installation is a little weak is in the area of curves. It comes with some tools like the Arc, Two Point Arc, and Three Point Arc tools, but beyond that, doesn't offer too much help for creating curved lines. This extension by author Fredo6 is a collection of many tools designed to help you create better curves. Basically, this set of tools allows you to create curves by working with control points, allowing more flexibility in curve creation and adjustment. But the main thing to note is that all these curves, once created, can be edited after the fact by going back and moving the various control points. In addition, all of these curve types can be converted to other curve types by right-clicking and selecting different line types. These line types will be generated using the control points you set when you first created your line. In addition, it's important to note that you can add control points by double-clicking on the control lines, allowing for even more flexibility in the way that you create lines with this extension. Finally, one of the best features of this extension is that you can come back into lines that have already been created and edit them using the control points you'd created before. So you can create a line, right-click, select edit, and then edit that line as long as it was created with the Bezier Spline extension. When coupled with other modeling techniques, this extension allows for a lot of interesting ideas for new shapes that you can create using curves in SketchUp. Tomorrow, make sure you tune in for a tutorial on how to use this extension along with a couple others to create this shape. That's where we're going to wrap up this extension overview. Leave a comment below and let me know what you thought. Have you struggled with creating curves in SketchUp? I just love having that SketchUp conversation with you guys. Uh, if you like this video, please remember to click that like button down below. If you're new around here, remember to click that subscribe button for new SketchUp content every week. If you like what I'm doing in this channel, please consider visiting my support me page on my website. Um, that's the sketchupessentials.com slash support. That's got everything from some extensions you can purchase to help support the show to links to my Patreon page. But in any case, thank you so much for taking the time to watch this. I really appreciate it, and I will catch you in the next video. Thanks, guys.